from Azimio Laomo, One Kenya Coalition Party. The Azimio Forum statement. A meeting between the leadership and governors elected under the umbrella of Azimio Laomoja, One Kenya Coalition Party, held at the Pride Inn Paradise Hotel in Mombasa, Mombasa County on Friday, 29th of September, 2023. Today, the Azimio Laomoja One Kenya Coalition leadership held a productive consultative forum with governors elected on political parties affiliated to the coalition. As a coalition, we believe in good governance, a strengthened devolved system of governance, and a proper and equitable distribution of resources to spur development in the counties. 17 governors attended the meeting for St. Apologies. We believe that the 2010 Constitution provided a platform from which Kenyans can directly benefit from the national cake through devolution. The objective of our meeting is to ensure that county governments and as the Mula Omoja One Kenya Coalition work effectively to the satisfaction of the people. After all, a good leader is measured not by the words he or she says, but by what they do to change the lives of the people who put them into office. The meeting took stock of ups and downs of devolution for the past one year after the August 9th, 2022 general election, and particularly the challenges county government face in the delivery of services to the electorate. Governors and deputy governors present made presentations about financial challenges and bottlenecks they encounter as they discharge their constitutional duties. The biggest problem in the country today is the high cost of living, over taxation, increasing fuel prices, and unemployment. It is worth noting that the financial problem the country, the country is facing Attempt by the national government to take over some, some of the functions of the county governments is another major problem. Whereas county governors are trying hard to discharge their duties as prescribed in the 2010 constitution, the national government is, on the other hand, trying much, how much harder to pull down their legs and suppress them. It is worth noting that devolution is the best thing that ever happened to the people of Kenya, of Kenya in terms of service delivery, has the need for the strengthening, re-energizing, and well-funding. In the spirit of separation of power and division of functions, under the 2010 Constitution, the Azimio La Omoja One, One Kenya Coalition leadership and county governors elected on the coalition parties resolved as follows. One, that the national government should respect the Constitution and stop meddling in the affairs and functions of county governments. They should desist the current, from, the, from the current interference in the mandate of devolved functions such as distribution of fertilizer, construction and opening of markets, health sector, and commissioning of industrial parks. Two, the national government should release funds allocated to county governments in time 
for the effectiveness and efficiency in service delivery. This will go a long way in averting industrial actions by the workers and end up slowing down delivery of service to the people. Three, that there is need to amend the County Government Act to have money allocated for the counties released on time to stop the current bureaucratic requirements where governors and officials from counties travel to Nairobi in the name of pushing for approval of their requisitions. Four, governors should be given a free hand in the management of the affairs and the discharge of duties in their respective counties. The national government's role is to fund them as per the law and not to coerce governors into submission. The two levels of government should complement each other and not one being subordinate to, the, to another. And the Constitution states clearly that the two levels of government are distinct. Must work. Ongoing national dialogue that has brought together representatives from the Azimio La Omoja One Kenya Coalition and the Kenya Kwanza aimed at fixing the major problems ranging from the high cost of bungling of the election that end up compromising democracy, respect for political pluralism to ensure growth of political parties, among others. We want to the talks to be people-centered, focused, and that there must be a show of commitment by all parties. Even as talks go on, we shall continue to pursue justice for the victims of, victims of police brutality during our peaceful demonstrations. Six, we encourage good, good, we encourage good intergovernmental relations in the spirit of Article 6 of the Constitution that demands both levels of government to conduct their mutual relations based County governments and as Mueller or Moja One Kenya Coalition shall endeavor to diligently serve the people and demonstrate our commitment the devolved system of governance and oppose vigorously any attempt to discriminate against any community and or region of Kenya on the basis of political persuasion, ethnicity, race, or religious faith. Eight, the, in, the intended privatization or concession of the port of Mombasa by the old administration remains a misery. We are perturbed by the decision to have the, the port privatized or concessioned without public participation and the involvement of county government of Mombasa. One would ask, why is the process shrouded in secrecy? What is the economic value of the privatization stroke concessioning to Kenya? The people of Mombasa, Mombasa County, and the coast region as a whole. As the Mule Moja One Kenya Coalition does not support or concessioning of the port, and we shall resist it until the issues Kenyans have raised are openly and adequately addressed. We demand required by the law and the meaningful engagement of the representatives of the people. Nine, 
encourage all counties to build respective government departments and public corporations for pending contributions in lieu of rates and development fees. Ten, for the evolution to be enhanced, we recommend that the allocation of resources to counties should be increased from the current 15 to a minimum of 35 percent. This proposal will be presented before the National Dialogue Committee sitting at the Bombers of Kenya, uh, of Kenya for consideration. It is in line with the Azimio Manifesto, which will be presented to the people of Kenya last year. We shall continue to caucus and hold frequent consultations to have governors and senators exchange ideas, share their experiences and problems with the aim of improving service delivery to the people. God bless Kenya. Thank you. Thank you very much.